Let's continue then, and begin obtaining the corresponding detail plans for this beam. So, I'll go to the View tab, and ask for a new sheet. Now in this window, we should select the corresponding size for the new sheet. In this case, let's say, a 90 by 60 sheet. Let's place it about this area for example. There it is. I'll also adjust the view's name position. But let's continue, and place additional views. Let's say, the perspective of both the beam, and one of its connections. There. Although we need to adjust their current scale, and that we can perform through the properties of the view. For instance, 1 to 5 for the perspective of the connection, and 1 to 20 for the one of the beam. I'll adjust the position of both the view, and its corresponding name. Done. Let's obtain some additional views. For instance,